what is up guys and welcome back to the channel so today is another sunday lawn care video it's been a while but i finally got my last box uh, i think a week or two ago now um so anyways uh i'll show you how the yard is looking real quick it has been pretty hot and dry recently um but i do have a little bit of irrigation back here in the backyard so uh i'm you know i there's a couple of things that i need to iron out at some point um you know i am on well water and uh so unfortunately there's not enough pressure to run um more than two sprinklers so uh you know it is what it is i just make do but for the most part the yard is looking pretty good so as you can see it is doing really well got a little brown patch here but this area was already thin this area always has a problem every year that um i guess doesn't get too much water but i've been doing a pretty good job and also i think the sunday lawn care products have really been helping this year um because last year i did not use the sunday lawn care products and we got really hot and dry and the yard looked way worse than this so uh I just want to remind you guys that this video is not sponsored, but I will have a affiliate link down in the description. And uh, so if you guys want to check out uh, Sunday Lawn Care's products, uh, please use that link below. Um, it, you know, the proceeds from that will uh, help keep the videos like this coming. So I would greatly appreciate that. So, uh, something I just noticed, um, not sure what we got going on here. Looks like a whole bunch of red ants or something. Yeah, that's, that's kind of weird. Anyways, um, yeah, so let's, uh, let's go over the box and, uh, see what we got. And then we'll get to, uh, doing the application. Alrighty guys, so as always... You got to remember to uh, keep your hose end sprayer because you always need this for your application. So, you know, I grabbed this out, have it ready to go. Yes, I've already been in the box. I believe. Okay, so here we've got the uh, Sunday grass machine. It is uh, Iron Deep Green Nitrogen Lush, Lush Growth and Seaweed Extract. Um... So this one is going to be the summer one. And uh, again, you guys can go online and check it out. This is uh, uh, 1503. So um, you'll, it'll help, you know, get the grass growing for the summertime um, and keep it nice and green. Uh, this does cover 3,000 square feet. I'm about uh, 1,000 square feet here. So... I'm not going to end up using this entire pouch. And again, I don't know if I said uh, this is my last box. So I will not be receiving any more boxes this year. But uh, then here we have the Fall Fortify plus Micronutrients. This is the late season fertilizer. It extends greening into the fall, encourages deep, strong roots, and enhanced with micronutrients. This one covers 5,000 square feet. So... In the fall, when I go to use this one, um, not hardly going to be using much of it. Um, 2200. So again, both of these you will hook up to the uh, hose end sprayer, and that's how you will apply them. And it is okay if you don't use the whole pouch. It will be good, you know, for another application if you ever want to do a second application for some reason, or you know, next year. So, um, yeah, like I said, just remember to keep your hose end sprayers. Mine at the beginning in the spring came with two of them, but I've not had to use the second one yet. So let's, uh, get the, um, grass machine sprayed out and, uh, we'll see in, uh, I don't know, a week. We'll see what the difference is in a week. So... Alright guys, so 
get this opened up real quick. Yeah, and uh, it is really humid out here, so I apologize if I was uh, <laughs> sweating a moment ago. Oh, something I always seem to f forget to do is you got to make sure you shake these. It does say that in the directions that you should shake them. So, like I said, this covers 3,000 square feet. I've got 1,000, so we're going to go just below 3 because, as you can see, this isn't quite to 4. So we'll go just below three. We'll go a halfway or so, maybe, maybe even down to two. Just trying to think. <laughs> All right. So we'll get hooked up here to the hose. Might be a little bit easier. Sorry, guys. Hook this up. Then I'm going to go up here. And the nice thing is, is I have, obviously, like I said, some irrigation back here. So anyways, I can just get on my app and go to my timer and uh, see as you can see 96 degrees they're saying 89% chance of rain that's not what I saw on the weather so hopefully it doesn't rain and you can see then when the next time is this is going to run I'm going to use this because this is what it's turned on to so I'll give it 15 minutes I don't think I need to I'll go 20 confirm so this should be turning on it says it's on so now we'll turn this on you have to wait for it to start coming out Houston, what's the problem? Houston, we have a problem. <laughs> Let's make sure this didn't turn off for some. No, it's still on. All right, hold on a second. Oh, I guess there was some junk in the hose that got in here. if you guys can see maybe apparently there's a bunch of junk in there for some reason so uh bear with me a minute well i'll get back well, i am uh just standing out here it's so humid i mean we are under uh, an excessive heat watch and i am sweating bullets just standing here so all right anyways let's get this on the road show on the road all right so now i can smell the product so we're just gonna start spraying it down and I'll try to make sure I can keep you guys in the frame here and to be honest with you if I use more I use more I'm not worried about it so you apply this
So I do still have uh, some beads in here. guys so as you can see I've used really about half of the pouch um, so but at least I know that I should have good coverage on everything so that's what the most important thing is so hopefully using this grass machine it'll help some of these brown spots um, which is just due to heat stress. Um, I did have to, like I said, because I have to use sprinklers differently. Um, I haven't had the sprinkler that's, you know, over there um, on for the last week or so. So, but I'm going to get it switched back up there, stays in the shade. So there shouldn't be too much, uh, um, you know, that, that gets more shade up there. So that, that'll be in better shape. But like I said, uh, I'll make sure that I try to bring you guys back in, you know, maybe about a week. Um, see how it's going um, after applying the grass machine. Uh, one thing I do want to say is don't mow for a couple days after applying this. And try to stay off of the grass for at least half an hour. Um, I think it says even all the way up to um, 24 hours or something like that. So, uh, but yeah, so like I said... Um, you know, uh, if you guys are interested, check out my link down in the description. And um, I would greatly appreciate it as the commission that I make from that will, again, help the channel and keep things like this going. And as always, guys, drop me a comment below. Let me know what you think. Subscribe if you haven't already. Smash the thumbs up button. And uh, we'll catch you guys on the next one. Peace.